Can you see that? Severe weather warning, strong winds for today, possible travel disruptions and power outages. Good morning guys and welcome to Krakow, Krakow, Poland. We were supposed to be going on a couple of day trips over today, um, but that can't happen because the weather, and we got that scary text last night, has taken a turn for the worse. So I'm sure today has to be pretty much filled with chilling, eating a lot of food, having some drinks and getting some work done. We actually cannot believe that we, don't know if you can see it there, are staying at the Sheraton, um, which is right on the river, opposite Vavil Castle. Um, we have some unbelievable views, but yeah, I just can't believe that little old us get to stay in somewhere like this. And in our room, I don't know if you can see, but we had this beautiful newspaper, little cookies, and it has all of the history of the Sheraton of when it opened its doors in 2004. Oh my god! I'm excited for this. I've been on the TV and they've got the hotel info thingy here and the buffet breakfast looks like quality, like real quality. I love the open planness of this as well. It's like you come out and you can just see the whole hotel. It's very hotel. tropical, doesn't it? Very tropical. You wouldn't think you're in a city. This is crazy. There are so many different options. We have like just a smoothie table. We've got all our cereal and fruits tables. We've got a pastry table. We've got a cold meat section. And we've got the hot section over there. This is literally what is needed on a lazy day. How cute are these little smoothies? Sitting, number one, I'm getting fat today. It's a lazy day, I'm getting fat. And when you stay at a place like this, they always go the extra mile. So there are more miles for you to put in Get in round two, That's round three, excuse. round four, round five. Yeah, no thank you. Thunder, lightning, and I've never seen it before. Thunder, lightning, and snow. All at the same time, along with like 40 miles per hour winds. This weather is ridiculous. It's so lucky that we didn't head out today. Um, I've never seen that before. I didn't know that you could get thunder and lightning with snow. I don't know, or I've never been in a snowstorm before. I have no idea. I can't really capture it properly on the camera, but there is nobody outside. There is lightning going straight into the river. Um, I think we'd have definitely got stuck today. If we'd gone to do the tour we we're gonna do, I think we'd have got there, there'd have been no coming back. Time for the gym. This is really cool. On the way to the gym, they have got all these old posters from different Olympic Games. And what also is very cool is that for the first time since probably the new year, I've stepped foot into a gym. So um, maybe it was good the weather was bad for once because it is forcing me to work out. It's actually, this is hard to talk and do this. I've been here for so long. A really big gym. Most of have a tiny gym, but this is going to be horrendous. My back is going to be like an old man's in the morning. Well this is a sight, it's a sight to behold, Molly in a gym. Go away, like, I'm working out. Is this, what's this, New Year, New You? New Year's resolution is to try and go to the gym. Pretend. You feeling pumped? I'm feeling pumped for what, my what, one. What even was that? My one workout that I did on my legs. But we will show you our room tour here. Still, like, actually can't believe that we're staying in such a beautiful room. But we have the biggest bed ever. I can it's very... brilliant. I can I can lose you in the night. I was literally just about to say I can very safely sleep knowing that Matt is nowhere near me. Um, we have our sliding wardrobe space, and we have a coffee machine. I've not managed to work that out yet. So don't worry about that. TV, which has the little info thing on it, which is super cute. My desk, full of rubbish, because I've been busy working. And 
the Pierre de la Resistance. Is that what they say? I but have you no have idea. an unbelievable view. Hold on, look at this. How is it this clear now? We literally had the thunder, worst weather, thunder, earlier. lightning, and snow, and now it's. Look at that calm. sun glow, and then also, obviously, we've eaten half of our dessert here, so we could read the newspaper. Um, even that, though the weather's like that, I'm um, I'm still not going out. No, I'm in fact, in. I think I could possibly just end up crawling back into bed. We also have a bathroom, I forgot to mention that. Um, Which we so, need to get in and get ready, because yeah, it's almost dinner time. I won't even bother showing it to you, but I think I'll probably lay in bed, get in the bath, and then we can go and have dinner. Mr. Mr. Avier. Mr. Avier. My, uh, my protein shake, and we have made it to the club lounge. And this looks like a little bit too much food considering this is the snacks. And we've got dinner in a minute. Oops. That is the perfect place to relax. So basically the club lounge is kind of like an airport lounge I suppose you could say. Um, if you are a member or you want to join it you can actually go and get snacks um, all day, drinks all day and at some points in the evening you can have alcoholic drinks, hot snacks. Um, and it's just really, really cool. Like you're in your own little area. At the minute, the new area is under renovation. So when that new area is done, you will be sitting somewhere up here at the top with a huge area and space. Um, we just love being able to sit there for an hour or so before you have dinner, have a couple of drinks, have some snacks. Um, and yeah, it's just so cool. Now we actually do get to go and have dinner. That is so, so cool. This is a smoking donna, and we are here about to have dinner. But before we have dinner, we've got to try a couple of signature cocktails. Can, can you believe the smoke? It, it's definitely smoking, it is on fire. Oh, that's really good. The bourbon's warm. This is what I mean, I didn't want to leave the hotel today because it's so cold outside, and that, is so needed. Estravier. Estravier. That was like How a cocktail show. Cool. Oh my god, I love it. And you see mine says, alcohol may not be the answer, but it's worth a shot. I, I totally it's, agree. It, no, it's not always the answer. That's not, it's not the answer, kids. But it's worth a shot. Yeah, it's always worth a shot. But this is the brand newly opened Anima restaurant. Um, and I just love it. The open planness makes it feel so different like the dynamic is here is crazy being able to see the bar you've got the open restaurant as well um, and it's italian and it's italian yeah what do we even order look at this like what do we get that is the question all i know is that my cocktail had amaretto egg white and lemon in it and it tastes very nice i have never had this in any italian restaurant i've been to this is incredibly anywhere. fancy we have focaccia balsamic vinegar and rosemary olive oil. But it comes on a, on a, tray. On a tray. On a, a trolley. trolley. A trolley of, I don't even know what you'd explain it. Condiments. Condiments. And this looks like Francis Focaccia. Is that the right word? Yeah, that is the right word ever we've had. ever seen. Well, this is very Italian. It is very Italian. We could be in Rome. Are we in Rome? We could well be. We, we, we literally could be in Rome. So we had a burrata to start, which I'm not sure I've had before. Molly thinks I have. We had it in Ukraine once. Oh, but I, I didn't think I liked it, but here it was amazing. And I've got a lasagna oh, for me. I was going to go with that a pizza. That looks so cute. I was going to be go with the pizza, but I was like, it fills you up to, I don't even know. I'm not eating that yet. That's going to be too hot. As money's too hot, how is your pasta? It's so good. The pasta's like al dente, and I think you find that in most sort of fancy Italian restaurants. I've got like dried aubergine on the top and ricotta. Oh, that pasta was so, so good. As I said, with fancy restaurants, especially fancy Italian restaurants, they always do the pasta shells al dente, which I really, really like. But that is our whole day relaxing and I can't believe we were able to do it at the Sheraton Hotel. Um, Basically, we spent our whole day showing you what we would normally have done on a bad weather day. I can't believe that Krakow had such bad weather and weather warnings coming through to the text. But tomorrow, hopefully, the weather will be better and we will be heading on our day trip, the first of two to come before we head out of the city. So we will see you in the next one for that.